in the yard. It's a real pleasure to see you again.
<laughs> it was awful. <laughs>
So Alex Chilton was the vocalist for the letter and Cry Like a Baby for the Box Tops. Y'all remember those songs, right? And after, after the Box Tops, um, Alex went on with uh, Chris Bell and co-wrote a bunch of songs and had a band called Big Star. And they did three albums that nobody heard of until right now. About 18 years later, Big Star started to catch on. And there's a documentary that was just out this past week in LA. Uh, Nothing Could Hurt Us. Uh, Highly recommend if you're into documentaries, and especially if you like Alex Chilton and Fox Hops, uh, you should try to catch it. You can see it on iTunes for only $6.99. So uh, it's a great story about Alex and where he came from, the Box Tops and uh, Big Star. So uh, that's uh, why I picked it. What's your name? Not in reverse. That's the first time we hear a play that song. So they could tell. So I have a little surprise here. Besides all the um, TV shows we did, uh, there was a little uh, radio show, and uh, you might remember this. This is Casey Kasem with American Talent. Oh, Talk. yeah. Before we hear the one most popular song in the <laughs> week, let's see what's at the top of the other charts. On the soul chart, number one is Sideshow by Blue Magic. On the country chart, number one is I Don't See Me in Your Eyes Anymore, Charlie Rich. The number one best-selling album this week is Band on the Run by Paul McCartney and Wayne. And on Billboard's National Singles the, the best-selling song in the USA, number one, Billy Don't Be Here.
one? Sure. Sit now. Stop 